Okay, guys, so I went to Target and I got a blaster box of Bowman Platinum 2012 and a pack of this Tristar Obac. Obac. Never even seen this product before, but it was at a Target I went to, so I decided to pick it up. And a pack of Heritage. So, um, that, this stuff, I didn't get anything out of at all. And the Heritage, the insert cards I got was Velez finishes off for Texas, Friendly Foes, and Dark Jeter New Age Performances. That one's decent. Um, and then the rest are just base, so if you're interested in base. And if you're looking to like complete the set, I got like a couple boxes at home. And then for the platinum, this is just base. No one, uh, no one that really like stood out. There are some decent players, but that's just base. Or and then for the base that stood out, or I thought stood out, I got a Derek Jeter and uh, Michael Pineda for my PC. So. And then a gold um, parallel, which is Kobe Ellsbury. And a green or emerald parallel, Jerry Parker rookie card. Uh, rookie cards they got were a regular Jerry Parker, a Brad Peacock, and a Matt Moore. That's pretty good. Mail. Then for prospects, got Willie Peralta, a Starling Marti, a Garen Shashini, a Billy Hamilton, and these are refractors, I think. They're, they're chrome, they feel, they're definitely chrome cards, they feel like. Zach Cohn, I think that's a refractor, I'm not sure. A Corey Spangenberg, the same thing. And a Sean Buckley, I think this is an X Factor, X Factor, I'm not sure. Um, then I got a top prospect, Billy Hamilton. And a die cut of Justin Upton. These are cool looking. I like them. And what I wasn't expecting at all is I pulled an autograph. It isn't a great autograph. But it's an autograph in a retail box. So it's not numbered or anything. Brian Brickhouse. I think I might try to get the whole set of uh, the base and the prospect set. Maybe the auto set. But I'm not sure. So if you guys know what these are called, this one and that one. Let me know. And if you're interested in these cards, let me know. Thanks, guys. Subscribe.